In this video, I'm going to show you how to go in and clean up your exported Grade Center um, grades that you grabbed from Blackboard. So the first thing you're going to notice is that obviously you've got extra content that you don't want. You have um, information that is um, the columnists are too small. You might decide that you want to format the numbers a different way. One of the first things that I would do is go in and take the first row. So I'm going to select on the first row and do a wrap text. If you have an older version of Excel, you might want to go to Format Cells and um, under, I think it was Text Alignment, you would use the wrap text option to get the text to wrap around within the cells. Now one of the things you're going to notice is each one of these headings in here has some extra text. So to edit this, you would double click on the cell and you can select the extra text and delete it and then hit enter and you can do that to each one of your columns to go in and kind of clean them up All right. the other thing is you're going to notice that the last access column has um, a different format so you can't see what the date is so I'm going to click on the letter for the column to select the whole column and up here in the number format I'm going to go in and pick short date if you were using an older version, you would go to Format Cells and go into the Number tab and pick Short Date in there. To or yeah, underneath the list of options that you could use, you could pick Short Date and OK that. And this way, you'll be able to see the dates for the students. The other thing that you might have is yourself in there as a test student. So I would want to get rid of that row. So you're going to right-click on the row number and do Delete to get rid of that row. If you have um, a, an extra column that you don't want, you can right click on the column letter and delete that. Um, if you have data you don't want, you can select it and delete it. If I want to format my numbers, I can select the whole sheet. There's a little button up in the upper left hand corner above the number one and to the left of the letter A to select all. And I can go into uh, my number format and decide how I want those to look at this point. Right now, the percentages. But basically, what I want to do is just decrease the decimal places. All right, it doesn't want to do it because of the different lengths here. So I'm going to go into, um, I went into this right here. And under number, I'm going to use percentage. And I want to decrease it down to two decimal places and hit OK. And that cleans up your numbers a little bit. If you want to change column widths, you go up in between the columns and you can click and drag. Change the column widths. Okay. If you decide you want to take the text and rotate it, I can select the text. There's a rotate tool in here. And I can do um, rotate up. And it will turn it sideways so I can make the column width smaller if I need to. Alright, so that's one way. Um, now when I just did the whole thing, I screwed up my... Uh, last access so I want to change that back into a short date okay um, so those are some of the things you might want to do just to kind of clean up your spreadsheet